when it comes to uh, the capsules, the NAD, the, the NMN capsules? Uh, mm -hmm. Is it just regular? Uh, yeah. So, so the capsules uh, that we use, they don't contain any maltodextrin or other, um, you know, synthetic compounds. So it's all vegetable cellulose, which is basically natural and it's vegan friendly as well. So there is no concerns there. And as to, um, you know, taking the NMN out of the capsule, I think that this is basically not necessary. And this is what, and, you know, I, I do this myself as well. I just take the capsule because uh, all of the studies that we have, uh, seen so far with NMN where the efficacy of the compound has been uh, shown in humans, they were all taking a capsule, right? So oh, no one was yeah. breaking it down, no one was taking the powder. Same in, you know, rats or mice, they're just putting the, the NMN into their water, they're drinking water or something. And they're not, because I'm, I'm hearing things like, oh, but the sublingual powder is better or, oh, right. the, uh, you know, <laughs> I don't know, the, the nasal spray is better or whatever. We actually don't have any data that show that this is a better form. There is like absolutely zero data on this. All of the um, studies that we have seen so far is with oral supplementation. And, um, you know, when we are looking into the NMN transporter as well because there is we do have an NMN transported in the cell where we take it and then it's being um it's entering the cell through the transporter and this transporter is actually um highly expressed in our gut so oh, this okay. is the reason why you know like there is no need for all of this i don't know nasal sprays and and, and whatnot and you know i had a manufacturer contacting me saying oh you should uh, put your nmn into transdermal patches and uh, actually <laughs> if you have a look at the expression of the transporter in different tissues there is no expression in the skin so why would you put it in a oh, in a wow. transdermal much this you know and i don't know if people have already done it but i know that there are a lot of different forms it's just my take-home message from this is that you know you should always evaluate whether uh whatever a manufacturer or company is saying is actually backed by science or not hey everybody this was a part of my ongoing conversations with dr sarah nova if you're interested in learning more please take a look at the links below uh, and also remember there is a discount code there if you'd like to order some, uh, some of NMN from NMN Bio. Uh, that is her company. So hope you enjoyed this video. Look for more to come.